Hello, I haven't put a video out for a while, so I thought I'd just put this out and just have something. I'm waiting for Tough Lady tomorrow. I'm waiting for somebody to upload a video so I can upload another video. But basically, this is an update on my ballistic mask. Um, what I've done is I've made it so that the bottom doesn't overhang your neck so much. Basically, just fold in the Kevlar in there. Um, I've also folded in right here so it looks a bit more like a mask nose cover right there. I mean, I've obviously painted it. And got that. I mean, I add, I've increased the layers from roughly 18 minus the metal mesh to uh, 30 layer, 29 layers of Kevlar, plus the metal mesh mask and whatever hot glue's in there. <laughs> well, I used some super glue for some layers. I'm not sure how that would hold together. I might be doing a testing video on this later in the future. But overall, it's pretty good. Um, Camo is okay. I mean, I mean, I do. I might do another layer, just to give it a little bit of variation later. Um, and I just added this. Pretty simple. Just a ballistic mask. Uh, cover just pretty much the entire lower half of your face, minus uh, the upper cheekbone. Cheekbone is up in here, and the actual Kevlar, because like this is cut out from Kevlar fabric, so the actual fabric itself. Gotta move that. So this is the actual fabric that I got from the side of the vest, as you can see. This is much better than the other side, so it doesn't have as much of this uh, fringing on it as the other one does. So basically a lot of the stuff in here is just um, material of Kevlar from the fringe stuff. So the main actual ballistic stuff is in this area. So yeah, that's the little update video on the ballistic face mask. and. Okay.